Have you ever wished you could read the thoughts of your friend, manager or relative? Surely a large percentage of people have wished this very much. So if we can do this we may avoid misunderstanding the actions and words of others. But can you really read what is going on in the mind of others like the book we easily browse? In this video, we will address 7 psychological tricks through which you can easily read and sense other people's ideas. 7 Amazing Psychological Tricks to Understand the Other Easily Some people believe that reading and understanding the ideas of the other requires special and complex skill. But modern science had another completely opposite view. This can happen with ease. So a group of scientists worked to discover ways to make it easy to read the other. Because this is very important in communicating with others more deeply and anticipating their future actions. And indeed these scientists have come up with easy psychological tricks that do this. First trick, don't release negative energy. If you're in a bad mood and feel nervous, don't export that energy to the other. Because you're going to reflect this negative feeling on him and then you won't know how to communicate with him. This has been confirmed by psychologists through many researches on this subject, all of which have confirmed that if a person meets someone else, and the first person is relaxed quiet, he will have the ability to know the other without much effort. And if the usual sentence at the beginning of any meeting with a person is replaced by the sentence how are you, with the sentence today looks calm and morale is high, you will lead the positive energy and the reading of the other becomes easy. And in order to train yourself dear reader on this, do not hesitate there's an answer from who asks you how are you by providing an honest answer. Trick 2. Spend enough time with the other person. Yes, it's the most effective trick. Spending enough time with the other party on a nice evening or long trip will make it possible to get to know him more. The duration as defined by psychologists starts from 4 hours to a year. Because spending so long will make predicting this person's reaction, its qualities or disadvantages. It's as clear as the sun. But the goal is not only to spend time, but this time has to be accompanied by a constant and productive dialogue, so that the psychological insides of this person become clear. There are many people who have spent time with people but unfortunately have not been able to know what is inside them. The third trick, listening to the tone of voice. Don't just enjoy the words that are said. Listen to the tone of the sound because it holds keys to the puzzle and decipher the other person's name. Listen to the tone and the speed of speech, and that's the first key if it's fast. This person is often nervous and vice versa. Perhaps this trick needs a realistic and somewhat careful judgment so that we do not make a mistake. The fourth trick, learning the language of the eyes. Studies confirm that the eye is the mirror of the soul, especially the pupils of the eye. A Japanese study has shown that if a person is confused and deeply thought out, the pupil expands significantly. It also expands when you meet someone for the first time but it narrows significantly if the brain is filled with a lot of information. If you notice when you first meet someone that the pupil has remained spacious, this is surely proof that you made a very good impression and vice versa. Trick 5. Breathing offers several important keys. If you notice how the other party breathes, you'll have an open book about this person, and you can read what's inside. For example, if the same person comes out of the chest directly, it means that this person is completely relaxed. If a person breathes a little deeply, it means he's feeling nervous about something. In case the breaths are running, this means that this person suffers from nervousness and may hide something he does not want you to see. Or maybe he's ashamed of you or he's uncomfortable with you. If breathing comes out of the abdomen, it often means that he is calm and his words with you are honest. Trick 6. You have to master the body language. Body language is the most obvious sign ever. For example, notice the forehead if it is curly which is a great indication that the person is stressed. The way he stands or sits, as well as his movement, are all indicators with great connotations and meanings. Scientists have set an example of this, that a primitive person if he wants to show his strength, he opens his arm excessively and may be beaten with his body and chest as well. The scientific reason for this is that when a person gets nervous, the cortisol is significantly reduced. The opposite occurs in a situation where a person is nervous. However, symptoms are weight gain insomnia and inability to sleep healthily. In this way, it is easy to detect a person's mental state by reading and interpreting body language, posture as well as activity. Trick 7. The most important and latest way to read the other. There's definitely a curiosity to know this trick, isn't there? We are also eager to know her. But this time you're the one who's going to tell us through the comments. Tell us how you read the other one and how did it work for you. It is not only for scientists, but also for actual experiments, and we are waiting for this experiment.